Hello, Anthony Orion for the Joker 3121 channel on YouTube. I, uh, I, I, I tried so hard to spare my enemies because he, the Bible tells us to love our enemies, which I do. I, I have this love-hate relationship. It's, it's a love-hate, but it's love for the overall good, wanting them to be okay too. You know what I'm saying? Wanting a surplus for everybody. Whether they like me or not has nothing to do with it. But there are conditions to... to uh, for them to, you know, not to have to... get harmed. Uh, the power of the Holy Spirit. And through my own... Uh, after, of course... Uh, of course through my own intellect here and here but that's how I do it because uh, I got so much dirt and I got the protection of the Holy Spirit God already told me if they do these things they'd be destroyed so I'm like why are they testing me why you know does that mean I mean how many times do I gotta say if you don't stop I'm going to talk and, and I'm trying so hard to avoid it and just go out there and get Christians because that's what the main things about the gospel. There's nothing more important than, than telling people about the good news, helping fall away Christians or people that fell away. And uh, yeah, there's a lot of trauma to deal with. You know, when the dawn finally shows, you realize that there's cleanup and you see the city, how knocked out it's been. And something happened, a black ops most likely... Uh, uh, I found out, and you know, you know, it sounds crazy, but I found out from my research and my own personal experiences that the Patriot Act pointed to a secret murder program, and they were actually coming to get me, and they failed, but they tried a few times, and <clears throat> then I had to sit back and watch as San Diego got torn to, to pieces. I mean, riots and a lot of prejudice in them and and uh, people tell me if I don't worship the devil blah 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 and I can't do that I can't worship a created being that's below me I can't worship a created being period if, if it above me I don't know why I said that it's just you know it's just just the truth I mean it's just pathetic why, why even even go there I mean common sense is still common sense however God is the only one. And if I'm failing God by my own weakness, what makes anyone think I'm going to worship anyone but God on top of that? That's even more reason to stick it in and, and, and get yourself right to perfect it. But I'm saved by the blood, which is justification. It, it's dark times. Uh, I'm sure I'm justified. It's, it's really a weird time to see such weird people. Now, are they people or are, are they have been taken over by demons? Well, you know, they give you black magic. Like Madonna, uh, they all, you know, the Illuminati. They do a black magic where they have to show it to you and then you manifest it. I remember, I could be wrong, but I remember Madonna had a, a music video at the award show where she basically said, remember I told everyone to have sex? Well, now we're going to come back and kill you. And as you die and go into hell, a creature's going to jump up into your body and take your body over. Thank you, suckers. But basically... And you have Harold Cross Vila talking about the, the skater waves and all the different, you know, uh, tech, which is on the nano level, right? And you start wondering what's really happening. Mind control? Oh, yeah. On steroids. Now, I, I caught them doing so much stuff. It's, I mean, it's almost like, well, I, I won't go there right now, but. <clears throat> and that's what's happening. San Diego has, and I, and I hope I'm wrong, but maybe, I mean, people as of now are missing. I'm not saying it's going to be that way forever, but San Diego is pretty empty compared to its usual uh, vibrant self. And there's no lines in the stores, so where are they at? Now, let's put it this way. Let's just say hypoth that hypothetically aliens invaded the Earth. Let's say fallen angels. Let's say aliens 
space aliens. So these space aliens, fallen angels, would go around and start killing people. And then when they people call in the, for the police, the police don't do anything about it. Well, who are you going to tell? What are you going to do about it? We know everything about you. We're watching you, but you can't see us. And we have superpowers. And next thing you know, people are gone. Horrific, horrific events transpired. Had your protection of God was removed off the nation, like I used to report about and get your heart right with Christ. But it wasn't enough. I wish there was something I could have done more. And it's like, if that's what happened, it's, it's too much. It's, it's way too much. It's like, Ah, it's, 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 you can't even hate on that level, it's just too much. Because you, if that was true, you would really hate them so much, there'd be no room for me. And then I wouldn't be able to look in the mirror and tell the universe how great I am. I would have to be upset all the time. <clears throat> no, it's, it's too much for me, so. What I do is I just give it to God. I already know it's well past my pay grade. I just hope that God, if that happened, comforted them and, and kept people as safe as possible. And I truly hope he took them out before they even saw too much stuff and he pretended that they were in that body. I hope he plays games too. Like the fallen angels never know when their buddies are gone and it's really God pretending to be their buddies. I mean, you can take this all kinds of ways. In Jesus' name, let it be. That it have been for a long time. Uh, send them a delusion. But they don't have accuracy of reality, Lord. Yet, if they cross the line with me, let them all be destroyed in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name. In the name of Jesus, by the blood of Yahshua, may they all be destroyed and taken off to the worst torment ever. Ever. I mean, like a trillion times worse than anything ever. And let them have to go through that for all eternity until we decide to have mercy on them. In Jesus' name, if they come toward me at all, or my family, or my friends. Now, if they did harm Lola, in Jesus' name, may 90% of them be destroyed in two days. In Jesus' name. Now, God he answers prayers when he wants. He's God. He's independent. I'm, I like that because one thing I do like about that is it shows me I'm not manifesting anything. <laughs> and that makes me happy. Because I don't want to be manifesting stuff and be relying on my own powers because I can't watch my back 24 hours a day and either can anyone else except for God. So I want a God that's going to, you know, watch my back for me. Okay, so let's say... Let's say they did what, what, what I think they did. And let's just say... Well, if they harm anyone else, destroy them... Utterly, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Give us a chance to get out there like I asked you for the intermission. Don't let them harm no one else. And let us have our chance to get out there like never before. And let everyone know your spirit and feel your spirit before they make that choice. And I don't have to go there and do anything. You can do it. I can help you. Either way, I can do it and tell them you're going to show up in a song or whatever. Any way you like. But it's, you know, I, I don't know what is even reality anymore to a certain degree. I mean, I'm not crazy. I don't hallucinate, but this uh, North Park, San Diego, I, look at look at, look at four years ago, I, they were trying to kill me, or at least it looked like they were trying to kill me. As in trying to come in my window at one in the morning, U.S. military, tried sneaking in my window at one in the morning. Uh, they tried opening my car door at red lights. I was reporting on Illuminati stuff and gang stalking and pizza gate and all kinds of horrific crimes that the government was caught in I mean, horrific stuff but as this is happening i start seeing miracles and then toward the very end of it i start i'm going to church and stuff and and suddenly the church is starting to get demonic they're, they're, they're like people on stage are saying something about satan this creepy stuff so uh It confused me because I'm like, what, what do 